Hey everyone, so we decided to share our Target and Amazon haul. So this is all little voice thing stuff for for the summer. Um, yeah, because this is our first summer for with P. And and size wise, he, roughly twelve to eighteen months. Yes. Um, so first, I guess we'll start with Target. So we obviously didn't have anything because this is his first, you know, real summer where he's going out. So we got him some cute um, short sleeve onesies. So this all came in a pack. So the little nautical fish theme, and it was a three, four pack. So a play no, one. two three packs, I think. No, four pack. Yeah, maybe. Sure. Um, so it came with a plain blue little. Unicorn whales. Unicorn whales. <laughs> Narwh narwhals. 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 <laughs> and then big whales. And then just green stripes. And then these cute little, I don't know what you call them, but the little button down. And it came, this set came with three. And these are all, they're both Cloud Island. Yeah, right? they're both the Cloud Island. And I don't remember how much. So we always, we always have trouble finding things like this for whatever reason. I don't, I don't know whether it's just we're picky. Natalie always tries to buy organic stuff but the cloud islands like the second best yeah because of whatever that oxa whatever uh, stuff. i don't even know if that's a sorry. real thing but but <laughs> it uh, sounds good but those are like the and also the target stuff is i think they're like eight, eight or nine dollars for a pack of three or four yeah so, so that's a really good price yeah and um and i guess we're picky too because we don't like things over the top kiddish and so these i think are are just nice um, so we got those, and then we got these adorable little shorts. So obviously he hasn't had any shorts, so these are super cute. So these I haven't washed it because they literally just came in today. So we have a little black pair, little gray pair, and then a little pink pair. We did order this in two different sizes, and then we decided to keep the bigger size. So this is actually 18 months, and we compared the 18 and the 12 months, and there was a very tiny difference. So we figured might as well get the bigger size so it'll last them a little bit longer. And the difference was almost all in the length. There was really no difference in the waist, but the length was uh, between the two, it was about a half an inch difference. So ultimately, isn't that yeah. a big deal? And, it's a little longer now. And like she said, these are the first shorts that we've really gotten for them, except for the shorts that we've had to, uh, to make because <laughs> he wore holes through all of his long pants. So, um, now he's just going to wear holes in his kneecaps, I suppose. So I don't know. <laughs> um, and then next is just, we saw this, and I don't know, it was just super cute, these little tie-dye trunks. So now I'm on a hunt for a tie-dye bathing suit so I can match him. And then we're going to um, my parents, and they live in Florida. So we got him this little rash guard so he's protected from the sand and the sun when we're down there. And again, both of those, I don't remember how much the swimsuit was, but nine dollars. If you if if you wait to buy something like this at the beach, obviously you're gonna pay probably like twenty dollars for it. I think this was like thirteen bucks. I don't know. I don't know. And it's nice because obviously it's got a zipper. It, if you've ever tried to put one of those or take one off when they're wet, they're not fun to get off. So I don't know if all kids once come the zippers, but yeah, I don't know. Um, and then we'll move to. Amazon. So Ari doesn't like these, but I think they're adorable. So I just think these are super cute, and so I bought them. Um, they're just three little stripes. And then if anyone's interested, I can put all the links to the Amazon stuff in there. Target I won't just because they're constantly getting new inventory, but for Amazon I guess I will. Um, so these are super cute. They're stripes. Um, were these organic? No, I don't think. I don't, I don't know, so. I don't but, but these were just super cute, and so I got them. And he likes everything with drawstrings, so I'm sure he'll figure out a way to chew on those. <laughs> and then he, since we haven't really gone anywhere because of the pandemic, we really didn't, I mean, we have shoes, but we never really put them in it, which I guess is kind of our fault, because now he's not used to wearing shoes, and then we had no idea what shoe size he is. Um, because like I said, we had shoes, but he actually, I don't think he wore any pair mm -hmm. other than the little Christmas ones that he wore. Uh, for our Christmas photos, but so we bought a whole bunch of shoes. So originally we bought these adorable ones, but they were too big, but we're keeping them because they're adorable. So they're just like speckled, colorful tennis shoes, and we figured they would go with anything. 
So these don't fit him yet. And then currently he is size four. So we bought him the exact same shoes, but they didn't have them in that colorful option for this size. So we just bought the, the plain gray. And then we have a very hard time getting shoes on Paxson because he likes to curl his toes. Now, I don't know if, I'm sure every baby does that, but I don't know if, you know, he's doing it more at this age because he was never forced to wear shoes. So it's really hard to get shoes on him. So that's why I bought these because I figured these would be easier to kind of, because they're more like stretchy, I can just easily slip them on. However, if I can slip them on easy, he can rip them off very easily. So when he wears this, he really can't get them off. Um, these he'll crawl around and all of a sudden it'll come off or he'll yank it off himself. Um, so that's a downside on that. Then again, since we're going to Florida, we got him little swim shoes. Which honestly, I think we're just going to end up, he's just going to probably wear those around in the grass and things like that too. Yeah. Because again, they're easy to get on him. But unlike these, they have a little strap. So you can kind of tighten yeah. it so they don't come off. And then, again, Ari wasn't nothing yet. <laughs> but I think these are adorable. So they're just like little Speedo boxer shorts. It's a swimsuit, it, but it's a stretchy material, kind of like the rash guard. Yeah. So basically this is like a speedo for little kids. <laughs> and it's not that I don't like, I like the pattern. I mean, lemons are great, but I mean. He's not a fan of the speedos. No. But I'm a Matt, it's like, you'll see photos, but he's going to look super cute with his little diaper bum in here. And I just think it'll be super cute with him waddling around. We well, can't walk yet, but hopefully, fingers crossed, he can walk soon. And then, last but not least, so these no, sunnies. We, no, we still have one more after oh. this. So these are old. We bought these when he was about three weeks old, um, and we loved them. But he got a scratch in them. I mean, did he do it with his teeth? I don't know what he did. Um, but regardless, he broke them. Well, he didn't break them. He, he scratched, scratched them, and now and... he doesn't like wearing them. So we had to get him another color. So we found these, which these are nice. They're the same brand. It's just a different color because I figured why not try something new. Originally, when I ordered on Amazon, I bought the exact same. So this is Coco Sand. I bought the exact same brand, and they came in. I didn't even notice. I guess I didn't pay attention, but Ari immediately was like, I don't like those because you can explain. So like regular eyeglasses, they have like the little pivot over here in the corner, and they have a uh, screw. But when children try to rip your glasses off, well, at least when Axel tries to rip mine off, he, First thing that pops in my head is he's about to rip the arm off the glasses. But these don't have that. They have a little accordion in the corner, and I'm sure you can't see that from here. But um, And Natalie keeps insisting on doing these things on the floor, and I can't move. But the <laughs> accordion corners make it a lot harder for them to damage and or break the glasses. So he can pull them off, and he can pull them down. Like a cool kid, he'll like peer, peer like out <laughs> above the glasses. But um, yeah, these are definitely uh, a lot more versatile and I would assume they will last a heck of a lot longer because we don't have to worry about them breaking. Yeah, and then this is the last item. So again, this is because of Florida, but also, um, so he has another cute little hat, um, which if you follow me on Instagram, you've seen him wearing it, but he, he rips his little hat off. So we figured in Florida, we definitely want him his little face to be in the shade. Plus, I don't want his scalp burning, which again, if you follow me on Instagram, you'll see that I've been rubbing sunscreen on his hair. Um, well, his For the scalp. sole purpose of giving him a mohawk, <laughs> not necessarily protecting his head. Um, so this way, he, his little scalp will be protected from the sun with this hat and he'll be nicely shaded. I can't speak on if he'll keep it on, but I'm hoping that's why I have the little string so I can kind of attach it and then hopefully it'll work. So, I don't know. I hope this was helpful. If not, then let us know and we won't do this again. Um, or maybe I will because I like looking at this, <laughs> this stuff. But anyways, um, I'll link the Amazon stuff. I won't link Target just because they're constantly getting new inventory. So, there's really no point. Oh, but I will add just because I see the price tag on these little shorts. If you have a little boy, buy these little shorts. They're super really? inexpensive. They're only $4 and they're really cute. And they have a little pocket. But anyways, thanks for tuning in. See you next time.